everybody. And welcome to this late night stream for the Europeans and uh, late evening for uh, USA in Brazil. Yeah, welcome guys to the stream. Hi, Rosp. Hello, Zeka. So yeah, we will see a re really interesting game right now between the Brazilians and, and Americans. Yeah, this is for the Group C, as they will decide who will top their group and who will finish second, as both are on a 4-0 record. Brazil 61 goals, USA 59 goals, so it's quite similar, as well as the goals they conceded, as Brazil deletes 35-39. to 39. So but the facts from this group this should be a pretty even game though what do you think yeah um i mean it will be interesting and uh, even game and the, the yeah americans have won this time um so yeah they have rose and they have chip overnight so probably quite a strong um, starters at least and the uh, Brazilians have, yeah, find the uh, three guys who are, who were champions a lot of times. So yeah, it's an interesting match. Yeah, it will be very interesting. Um, as we, as I see on the room now, it is only Japones, TNT, and Ghost. Yefola is missing. I don't know if he will join or not. But still, I mean, Ghost was on the bench a lot of times, but still, even when he was subbed in, he played very, very strong from the games I saw him play. So, this could be interesting how this lineup, how good it will be at the start of the game. Yeah. And take a look at the Americans. I mean, they got Dragonite, Chip, Rose, and now Monk, who's not a regular uh, player. So, he do not join regularly, but he is a strong one, though. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Monk is probably one of the best players in, uh, in Spacebound. And he's doing a pretty good job in 4 versus 4 games usually. I don't really know about his how he plays 3 versus 3, but uh, we will see. Probably he will play good. So yeah, um, I'm interested to see this this game. Yeah, I really am as well. This could be a lot of fun, actually. I think that the Brazilians will start aggressively as they did in a, a lot of games in the group stage, in these four group stage games they had. I mean, they had <clears throat> a pretty good game against South Korea as they were playing in my room closed over and over again. I don't know what it is, but as I said, they played in Korean room and then in Brazilian room and won both times. I mean, in the Korean room, it, it, it was pretty hard, but yeah, then again, um, I don't know if it should, I think it was you who said that Brazilians are familiar with playing with high pings and they yes. have a high ping here, here as well. So it should be even. If you look at the pings in the room, I mean, Americans have a pretty good ping right now. But even with seeing Japones TNT round about 150, is it a disadvantage or do you think even if it's 100 and more than the Americans that they can make it? 
Oh, well, yeah, of course, uh, Americans have big advantage here. Um, I mean, they're playing in America, so it's it's always better to to play on the host, uh, which is near your uh, your playing place. But yeah, um, but Brazilians they are just used to big ping, and uh, because they just play a lot of games out of uh, Brasilia, like in Europe and in America. Um, and yeah, just uh, it, it won't be a big issue for them, I, I would guess. But yeah, but it's definitely an advantage for Americans to have a uh, better thing. All right, so we take a look at the lineups as I think they will start like this. It's Dragonite, Monk and Chip starting for the US team on the red side and it's Ghost, Haponis and TNT. The only Brazilians in this room starting on the blue side as Yefola is missing and as we saw in Discord, Juventus is missing as well. Well, what very interesting point about uh, Yapola is uh, that he really liked to shit talk a lot, and he did already in, in the games before. And uh, yeah, they don't have him in this match, so maybe it will be a bit a bit more easier um, because there won't be a lot of spamming in chat. But uh, we will see. Maybe this team still, <laughs> even without him, likes to shit talk, so it could be both <laughs> ways, so yeah. Interesting, as Bo said, he will leave in 15 minutes, but by then the game should be done as it started now. No, 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 it's yeah. just this. No, oh, okay. As I see, Monk is not moving as well. <clears throat> so they test it now. And it's really good opportunity for Chip, who, the player who stepped up um, a lot in, uh, in this cup and scored, yeah. uh, was, was the leader of top scorers in one time. And yeah, it's, it's a really good opportunity for him to show what he's worth. Yeah, that's true, as we start the game now. USA had a ball and... Oh, and oh a goal. he scored! Five seconds in, Monk scores. As we talked about him, how good he can be, how good he is, how good he was. And but already, yeah. he's trying to take the ball control and uh, yeah. Oh, and he misses this against Ghost. Oh, nice move by Ghost. Great goal there. There would be will be a lot of this in this game. A lot of like uh, these mistakes because both play, both teams playing really fast. They like to bump a lot. They can leave a ball and uh, they like to shoot goals like that. Great goal there again. But we talked a, a lot about Chip and he really stepped up his game, but as I mentioned before, what about Ghost as he scored the second goal for Brazil? Because he was, he was a player who was on the bench at the beginning of the tournament, even in the last game. Now he has to start because Hefola, I think, isn't there. But he really stepped up as well, making well, this Brazil even better side. Yeah, yeah, and uh, the thing is with Brazilian team, it's again, this is the same team again and again in all the tournaments. They always uh, team up, and these old players, they are just really good. Like, uh, they have a uh, chemistry, like, like now, Go showed he just uh, taking the care of the ball and uh, scoring easy goal while his teammate clearing. 
and uh, goes. He is actually a good player, even though in, in this situation wasn't. But uh, <laughs> but he is a good player. He is uh, of course experienced player, and uh, sometimes leaving somebody on the bench isn't like a big deal because he isn't good or something. It's just because they're so stacked and they don't know who to play or uh, are just uh, mixing uh, the players or yeah it could be right like that maybe but he is definitely he is the player yeah that's true as we go two minutes gone in this half it's a four to three lead for brazil as now usa takes the ball chip into the corner couldn't control it great bound there no TNT with the ball control, waiting patiently, and now he can attack. And long shot from almost middle of the field, and it's another goal for Brazilians. Oh, massive team <laughs> bumping and oh, bumping party. Yeah, that's true. And Mog loses the ball, Dragonite takes it. And both the, the, those teams, they are just uh, comfortable to take a uh, ball from everywhere. Like, uh, yeah. if, if the team loses a ball, they can just try to shoot it uh, and, or try to dribble it. Some other teams just uh, are not as good with the first touch. Like, some of the players not uh, as good uh, with the first touch. They are just sometimes missing it and uh, can dribble past. Uh, but these both teams, they... I mean, maybe they make sometimes mistakes, but they are really good with the ball control, so they are comfortable to playing fast, and uh, that's why we are seeing this uh, that much bumps and uh, really fast tempo so far, and yeah, almost true. another goal. Oh, 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 oh. The post is saving the USA there from a four goal lead for the Brazilians as they should score now. Monk again. Making a third goal of the day. Again, mark the ball. Nobody to pass. But yeah, at least uh, throws it away. Now Dragonite could score there. Oh, I think. Oh. oh, great bounce there by Chip. Yeah, to that. Make drag to make Drago score this goal. He basically saved Dragonite uh, of that awkward uh, fall up. And now Chip almost oh. scores. <laughs> oh, and Monk misses as well. Oh, Ghost misses the X there. It should be going at all. Oh, oh yeah. monk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate. I just wanted to say to see how important monk is to this team. I mean, three goals, great bumps. Okay, this was a little bit unfortunate with the post, but still he makes this usa team better yeah and uh, yeah and this is uh, like uh, oh nice goal from chip and this is like isn't uh, just simple game like uh with other teams like uh, it's not even warm up it's it's a really huge game for both teams who will they get in another round and uh, and monk is delivering a lot he's doing yeah. a great job and that's that's how yeah, it should be and uh, another pass and uh, that's how, how it should be he's really elite player and he needs to deliver every time and he delivers of course so. yeah oh bad bad placement there by chip as opponent has no strength there he just needs to score on an empty goal two minutes left in the score 
in this, in this quarter. I just watch football <laughs> <laughs> in, in this half. And it's again a tie, eight to eight. And it's the game we predicted, a close game. Just waiting for the ball, maybe a bit too long, but now could be a nice tiki taka. At least oh. that's what happened. And Dragonite? Drago? Oh, misses the X there. Opponent is there. Oh, Monk, nice try there. <laughs> Oh, Chip wins the X should score there, oh, as he does. Okay. USA takes the lead in this game. <laughs> Great, <laughs> <is> pump. <laughs> Great pump there by Monk. And he scores as well. And it's not, it's not easy to bump a Brazilian team. Like you can bump at least one, two, maybe guys, but uh, bump all three and then instantly score. <laughs> yeah, it's just. Yeah, that's true. Now imagine this team without Monk in the playoffs. So that's why I'm saying that they would reach yeah. final. Yeah, that's true. That's pretty true. So I'm interested to see if the USA will sub any players today, as they had have they should growth. They probably uh, will, unless no, they true. unless they will uh, be losing or something. But now they're leading. I don't think so. I don't think so as well. Eight seconds left, maybe the US have another chance of scoring. Oh yeah, they will. Chip. Making it a four goal lead in the first half. Who would say that at the beginning that the US will actually lead by four? As Monk is even their top scorer, scoring five goals in this game already. Chip with four. And Haponis is the best on the Brazilian side, scoring three goals. So by now, the US would take the first spot in the group and facing a fourth spot team in the playoffs. And this is a big advantage. Yeah. Because... A lot of uh, third, uh, like, like yeah, fourth. Uh, all the fourth teams, they are kind of um, maybe a bit easier to play, and uh, it's it's big advantage for for them. So they probably they are not playing because of that, like to win this game because of that, but uh, they just want to win against Brazilians, but. Uh, but in the end, it will be really huge if they will. And nice colors, by the way, on the USA team. Yeah, true. That's what I thought as well. <laughs> nice color there. Because in the first games, uh, they have they had like uh, really bad looking uh, colors. Almost they looked uh, as as Pol Polish team, I guess. And yeah, it was really bad looking. And now they are looking. Really good, that was nice. So it was twelve to eight, it was right? Yep. Yeah, so twelve eight for the US team. Oh and Mom didn't score there, but it was my chance. And now oh, Chip and brilliant. Mark. <laughs> Monk kind of steals it, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice steal there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at the end, it 
was pretty, pretty funny to watch, to be honest. Yeah, these guys are all entertaining and uh, they're all skillful. That's why it's really nice to watch. Yeah, that's true. Oh, Dragonite misses the bounce opponents, make it only a 3 0 lead for the US team. And as Chip scored in the second half as well. Bonus. Interesting try right there. And both oh, with the ball. Great eggs. Yeah. Great eggs there by Drago. Makes it an easy goal for Monk. Hmm. I mean, uh, what we just what we just see. I mean, it was like maybe twenty seconds, and we scored. Uh, they scored like five goals. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> This is quite impressive how fast this game is. Yeah, that's the thing, uh, the thing with uh, <laughs> those both teams that it's actually <laughs> sometimes just impossible to to see what's happening, and you're just so confused. And and it's yeah, it's pretty funny that uh, the result is actually quite equal, but. At the same time, it's yeah, Americans leading by six goals already. So yeah, it's uh, <laughs> yeah, um, I think uh, Brazilians really bad right now. So they will do everything they can to yeah, Brazilian <laughs> kickoff. I think I thought about this yeah. <laughs> because yeah, they need to do everything they can to win this game, and uh, they have like five minutes. It's possible with six goals only. But the monk saves for the <laughs> man monk with the great save there. Oh my god. Maybe he can and score OG? No. <laughs> oh my goodness, what a great save there. With a little bit of luck, but he can score. I mean this is how terrifying is this? You see Brazilians are behind by six goals. And then they go, okay, let's go Brazilian kickoffs. One of the maybe most dangerous weapons in hacks for. Yeah, and that's that's the thing with the with this team. It's uh, when they do this, they kinda are saying, Hey, we are playing serious now. Yeah. This monk is really flying, but still he managed to score some goals. This is... Oh my goodness, I don't know what to say to this. <laughs> well, that's why I'm saying that he's just an amazing player, because he's just flying and doing actually nothing, just bumping them around and still actually being better than them. That's... I don't know, it's just crazy. Oh, cheer! Oh, nice goal there by Chip. Oh, goes for the great X there. Monk with the save. And it's another goal. Yeah, now Brazilians, they. Now they have a big problem to overcome. Oh yeah, that's true. They are trailing by eight. Eight goals behind. Who would have thought that before the game? And this was a, an opportunity for Naponas. And when this caliber... <laughs> I just wanted to say that when this caliber team's playing, it's you just don't miss the shots. And then Mong just saves his uh, <laughs> uh, their goal from... from from the shot of his teammate. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. it's a pretty really ser serious game. And uh, yeah, another missed uh, bump there. Chip, no. TNT, patiently. Uh, no, shit, shit. Oh. no, why? Why oh. you do? Why you would do that? He saved you blame Slack. <laughs> yes. It's 
quite easy. I mean, the Brazilians are making too many mistakes right now. Too many team bumps, too many bumps where he could just shoot the ball. Too many shooting where he could bump the opponent. As opponent scored now. But I don't think, I, I think this is the Brazilian side we won't see in the playoffs. I think Brazil will really step up their game. And again, there is the other side of the medal that uh, USA are basically being kind of lucky too. Because, uh, I mean, yeah, it's uh, the flying of Monk, it's kind of sometimes, uh, how, how, would, uh, how should you say that? Oh, yeah, Pona scores another. <laughs> Happiness. but yeah it's like a bit lucky these these clients they're just uh, trying to do something like this like you will you won't do this since like when you're trying to win and he's just just flying again he will try to fly <laughs> and that's a bit of luck you, you should say so yeah it, on the other hand uh, American just having pretty good luck in this game and I mean it's it's it's, it's so impressive I uh, took a look at Mong for like the past two, three minutes. I just watched the game and see Mong fly past the screen over and over again and so, somehow still managed to get some bumps in there. And this is... This isn't real for me. I mean, I just see him fly past the screen every second and still... Somehow, USA is still leading there. Well, if, if, if this is the USA we will see in the playoffs... Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure they can dominate the team, but... Uh, yeah. uh, that's... I don't think that other teams will uh, go for this bite, like, uh, start flying and... Uh, yeah, Brazilians are just uh, like Yatori said in, when he was commentating. Brazilians are just kind of emotional. They can lose the, they can be, start being mad and then start playing bad because of that. And yeah, and when they're playing good, they can play even better because they're feeling good. And yeah. that's that's the thing with Brazilians. And I think this this was the match and the example of. Uh, how they can play bad. As <laughs> was close on God. <laughs> Just sub in 30 seconds ago. And the only thing he did in this game was an on goal. This is <laughs> I mean this was a great game. This was worth uh, streaming and watching. Yeah, it, it really was. Oh, oh Rose. My he, his stats now will be on the fire. <laughs> this was... Good radio oh my there. goodness. I mean... <laughs> um, <laughs> man of the man of the should be Rose. 30 seconds in scores for no goal. <laughs> uh, this was great. It, it really was. I mean, <clears throat> now, seriously, looking back at the game, <laughs> it, it, it's, it was quite impressive how US, even though Monk was flying, in the second half, after three minutes played, he was just flying in the game all and over again and still managed to bounce Brazilian players, make them team bounce, score goals. Um, this is a quality I never seen before in a team, <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, but... that's actually the same and I kind of know this uh, American team pretty good, so I, I would say that it's not usual they're doing this. <laughs> I mean, it's usual that they are flying, but it's not usual that they are destroying their opponents, which are Brazilians, in this kind of way. But whatever works, works, so yeah. 
Yeah, that's true. That's re that really is. So as we have now, US will top the group and have the easiest opponent, I would say. As now we will take USA could face Italy, Russia or Chile in the playoffs and Brazil could face Germany, International or the United Kingdom. So I'm sorry for the UK International Germany. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But still, uh, after, I mean, we saw it uh, today. I mean, still, Brazil scored 17 goals. It's still not that bad, but I mean, at the end, you can see if you. I mean, first of all, you have to control this kickoff if Brazil will play the Brazilians' kickoff. This is one thing USA did it, and on the bad day, even our teams and the United Kingdom can win against Brazil. I would say. Yeah, I mean it will be a really nice matchup. Um, and talking about matchups, uh, tomorrow at twenty-one Central Europe time, um, we will have the stream of. Drafts, I guess. Um, yeah, I'm inviting the, everybody to join us and to watch and to see who will be playing who uh, because it will be very interesting and the games will begin instantly. They can be played for uh, I think one or two weeks after this. So yeah, it will be really interesting and, and I guess we will see. See you tomorrow and yeah, just join us. And, uh... Yeah, one quick thing I would I just want to say um, on on the Discord channel, you guys, um, we will try to make it happen that we can actually make a report, a review, uh, a review of the group stage, and or not particularly of the group stage, but the teams who made it to the playoffs. To make a review of the group stage, how they performed, how they played, how are the ratings and if they make it far into the playoffs and after the draw like I said at 9 p.m. Central Europe time we will uh, make a preview of the playoffs matches and stay tuned for that, check Discord and yeah as Rob said, uh, said hope to see you tomorrow at 9 p.m. Yes. Thank you, Rosp, for the for the stream and for your presence. Thank you, Zega, for for joining me too, and uh, thank you for everybody for watching, of course. And then, everybody, good night. Good night, guys. <laughs>